guys, The Water Shoe Out here, and today I'm bringing you guys another epic waifu review. Now, I switched over my microphone from the last video, and hopefully this new microphone will be more louder than the previous one. So yeah. Now, today in the spotlight we have IJN Otago from the anime series slash game series Azur Lane. Now, I promise not to be biased when it comes to reviewing her, especially how she was my first elf in game. But yeah, now let's get straight into the review. Now, Octagos' design is very similar to her sister ship to Tao, rigging-wise. Just for those who are wondering, rigging is the armor slash weapons around the ship girl or the anime girl. From what I can see, Octago wears a white commander's uniform that kind of emphasizes on her very nice torpedo buttons, similar to her sister but she wears a different skirt, and she also wears a uh, black buttered belt with black stockings and also some white heels kind of show that she's more ladylike or more mature. You can also see a white ribbon tied up in her hair just like her sister ship, Cal. And then you can, oh, just like in the previous video I mentioned, Otago does have animal ears but they're more visible compared to her sister ship, the cow. But yeah, anyways, design-wise, I give her a 9.5. Otago is your typical Ara Ara Onesan. In-game, she likes to tease the main player, proven by some of her dialogue lines, especially her special touch line, which I can say is very nice. You can also tell that Otago is very caring because in the anime, or in episode 5 where she made her debut, you can see her comforting one of her friends, and that friend was Ayanami. I'll get into that in another video. And an in-game example of her caring personality, personality is in her quest line, where she tells the player, or the commander in this instance, not to stay up late and make sure he's not being unhealthy. When you get Otago's affinity to around crush and love, Otago gets a bit clingy, but when it comes to her being clingy, it's not on the same level as Kagi's clinginess where she will kill everyone who dares get close to the player or commander in this instance. Again, Otago's personality for me is a 9 out of 10 for me. Some people may not like the clinginess, but I'm not sure. I kind of like the clinginess because that shows that she actually cares about the player, and I kind of like that. So for the overall rating for Otago, she would be a 9.5 out of 10 with Duato's seal of approval. Now, don't take what I say seriously, but on this because I'm just a random person on the internet talking about cute anime girls. And this is just my opinion on them. So yeah, if you like this video, please like and subscribe for more content. Duato out.